Uh, hello guys, Dan here, uh, welcome back. Uh, in today's short video I will show you how to make this uh, alien planet base. I will also show you how to create these crystals and uh, make the grass tufts. I will use these uh, bases from my uh, infinity army that uh, I just set them aside before. Uh, so uh, to start uh, we will use a technical paint called Astro Granite from the Gangs Workshop and we will just spread it uh, in one uh, thick coat uh, all around the base. Uh, if you put it too thick uh, just remove the excess uh, and transfer it to another base or return it to the pot and then uh, just uh, spread it like evenly around and then leave it uh, to dry for one or two hours. I usually leave them outside because here uh, temperatures outside are like super hot. So I think in one hour they're like completely dry, but I wouldn't risk, I will leave it like for more than one hour uh, just to be sure that they're completely dry before uh, proceeding to a next step. So after we are sure that the uh, Astro Granite is completely dried, uh, we will use uh, Black Templar Contrast and just uh, paint the bases uh, fully uh, with the one very thick coat. After our Black Templar color is uh, completely dry, uh, it's time to uh, dry brush the Templar Guard Blue. Uh, I will use my uh, biggest uh, brush for dry brushing and just uh, remove most of the paint from my brush and then I will just slightly uh, dry brush it. Uh, on the base I think I'm happy like with the level of uh, paint that I have on, on the texture. So go into side to side motion, usually one direction, but uh, if you want to have like uh, somewhere heavier you can change direction on a couple of uh, uh, sides of the base. So just go and uh, do this on all of your bases. And last thing to do is to paint uh, the rim of the base with the color of your choice. Uh, my default color is always black. so. I always paint my rims black. Uh, now let's create some crystals. Uh, this is one of my old sprues that I have. Uh, so probably we all have some, some at home. So just take it and cut it in a little uh, pieces, like, like maybe like a one centimeter pieces or even less. Uh, you can use your clippers for it or, or a hobby knife. So just be careful if you're using hobby knife not to cut yourself or if you're too young, just ask uh, uh, someone older that uh, cut this for you. And then we will shape the, the tops of the crystals. So just go around and cut like from all four sides and create like a little like a pointy arrow uh, just to create the shape of the crystal. And on the base you can cut it uh, flat or cut it on the angle, depends. Uh, do you want your crystal to stand upright or uh, lay it down on the angled on the ground? So 
So after I dye them, I just stick some double-sided tape on, on my old box and put this crystal on top. So now I will prime them uh, with a grey primer, grey color. So you can use the spray paint for this or paint them with your paintbrush. I would just use to use the airbrush because it's much faster for me and I can just go through all of this like in a couple of seconds. And then uh, I will paint uh, my grass tufts with the Temple Guard blue uh, because I wanted some alien bluish, uh, purplish uh, grass, uh, but I didn't want to buy any because I have like a million uh, packs of these uh, green uh, grass tufts. So I will just paint them. Uh, you can use uh, spray paint for this, uh, you can do it with a brush as well, but. Uh, it's very difficult to do it with a brush, it will take so much time. Uh, it, it is doable, but uh, I think uh, I will advise you to use the airbrush or a spray paint. So I will just go around and then uh, lightly spray it uh, with the Temple Guard Blue, just until I'm happy with the level of, uh, of color I have on it. For the crystals I will use uh, Emperor's Children uh, and as well uh, I'll just spray them uh, with my airbrush. Uh, this is optional as well, you can paint them in any bright color you want. Uh, you can paint them red, bluish, uh, green, uh, up to you depends like uh, what kind of crystals you want. So you can as well use the, the paintbrush for this, uh, it's just a little slower but uh, the result will be completely the same. After everything is dry, we will just uh, edge highlight uh, our crystals with the uh, ultra and grey. So I will go ar all around and highlight uh, every single sharp edge of these crystals, uh, just to create like a dimension to it. And the last thing to do is that uh, I add uh, some Jean Stealer purple to my airbrush and uh, spray the grass tufts uh, again from the top. Uh, because when I spray them uh, blue, uh, they were matching my bases too much. So there was not a big difference between the blue on the base and these grass tufts. So I just went and sprayed them a couple of times with the purple. So they have like a really nice tone. And now uh, only thing is to do is to transfer everything to your uh, base and decorate them up to your liking. And that's it, uh, the bases are done. So guys I hope uh, this video helped you and give you some ideas. Uh, if it did please uh, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you have any suggestions uh, or comments what would you like to see in the future, please leave a comment below and I will do my best. So guys, uh, stay safe, take care and uh, bye bye until next video.